Race. The Arizona Senate race is turning out to be one of the most closely watched battles in the country. On top of being a close race, it's also really, really expensive. Kelly and McSally combined have raised over $144 million for their campaigns. Today, state party leaders attended a rally at Republican headquarters to drum up last minute support for Senator Martha McSally. This is part of a statewide tour that with just over 24 hours before the polls close tomorrow. McSally says that momentum is on her side. It's a binary choice. If you want freedom, you want a strong economy, you want safety and security for you and your family, then I'm your girl. If you want the radical left to take over, Mark Kelly will be the 51st vote for the radical left to take over power and never give it back, then you got a guy. It's that simple, it's a binary choice. Arizona is considered one of the nation's battleground states in part because of this race. Mark Kelly was also out on the trail today, spending time talking to supporters in Tucson with his wife, Gabby Giffords, the political hopeful, thanking the people who've helped his campaign. I served in the Navy for 25 years, but to win an election like this, we need an army. And the folks that are knocking on doors today are part of that army. That's what we can do now is knock on every last door, make those phone calls, send those texts to get folks out. And a new poll from the conservative-leaning Rasmussen Report shows Mark Kelly ahead of Martha McSally leading the Senate race by five points.